How long is the average penis in different countries? Do Africans have the longest penises? Which country, on average, out of these 12 countries, has the longest penis? In this second video of two videos, I will answer all of these questions and show you penile length research results from 12 countries that might really surprise you. Welcome to the Cure That Expert channel! Cure That Expert is a California Medical Board registered telehealth clinic focusing on men's health. Knowledge is provided by Dr. John Wu, MD, licensed U.S. physician. I'm Cure Expert Science Analyst and your host, Eileen. Also, if you find this video interesting, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe. This is the second video on the average penile length in different countries. For many men who might be anxious that they might have a small penis, I do want to re-emphasize that the global average length for erect or stretched penis is 5.11 inches or 12.98 centimeters and not 6 inches. That's according to this expert review that looked at 13,000 men in 21 studies. And I would like to repeat that for your penis to medically qualify as a very small penis, you need to have a penis that's smaller than 2.95 inches when stretched, as mentioned in this review. So most of you really don't need to stress over whether you have a very small penis or not. But if you're still concerned, please check out my past episode on 7 Scientifically Proven Ways on How to Increase Penis Length Based on Medical Research. So before I show the numbers for those countries, you must know that the numbers shown here for each country probably do not represent the entire country because some research studies have very few men. That means if one or two men with very short penises happen to be included in the study, it will pull the average number of the entire group down by a lot. And most studies that I will present today talk about stressed length, which is not the same as the erect length. Theoretically, erect and stretched penile length should be close to each other. But as we have seen in my first video, oftentimes the actual erect length is longer than the stretched length. So if you see a number and it says stretched, please do not take it as the absolute truth. The first continent I will talk about is Africa. Unfortunately, most penile length research from Africa is about babies. I was only able to find penile length research on adult men for two countries in Africa. The first is Egypt, which I covered in my first video. The second is Nigeria. So I found two studies from Nigeria. The first study has two groups of men. Group 1 has 97 men aged 21 to 50, and Group 2 has 174 men aged 51 to 98. The mean stretched penile length for Group 1 is 10.6 centimeters or 4.17 inches, while for Group 2 it is 14.1 centimeters or 5.55 inches. This study is very interesting because the results show the older men have much longer penises for some reason than the younger men. The second study has 115 men in it. The mean stretched penile length for these men is 13.37 centimeters or 5.26 inches. Before we go on, I have to really emphasize that oftentimes the actual erect length is longer than the stretched length. And Nigeria for sure does not equal all of Africa. At this point, some of you might be saying, I have heard that Africans have extremely long penises though. Well, the truth is, you might be right. Africans might actually have the longest penises. So how can I show this if I cannot find any research from the African countries that are not Egypt or Nigeria? I would say that you can infer this by looking at people with African ancestry living in non-African countries. The next research study, which is from Brazil, will shine a bright light on this. So now, South America. And the first country from South America is Brazil. According to this Brazilian study, 283 white Brazilians have a stretched penile length of 15.8 centimeters or 6.22 inches, 
versus 167 black Brazilians with 16.5 centimeters or 6.5 inches. Basically, this study is saying that black Brazilians have longer penises than white Brazilians by about 0.7 centimeters longer. With these numbers, Brazilian men may have some of the longest penises. There is another study that supports the conclusion of the Brazilian study. Of all places, the research study comes from Portugal. I actually covered Portugal in the first video, in which I mentioned that the mean stretched penile length for 498 men from Portugal is 15.14 centimeters or 5.96 inches. But extremely eye-opening is that this study also looked at Portuguese men with African descent. There were 19 African Portuguese men and their mean stretched penile length is 17.64 centimeters or 6.94 inches, which is the longest by far. I would add a note of caution though. 19 men is not that many men. So it could be the case that a few men with unnaturally long penises were in this small group, helping to raise the average number. Or maybe it's true that most of these 19 men really just have very long penises. We just don't know. So is it true that men of African descent have the longest penises? With the evidence presented, I would cautiously say yes, at least in Brazil and maybe Portugal. Continuing with South America, the only other country in South America besides Brazil that I can find research for is Argentina. In this study of 800 men from Argentina, the mean stretched penile length is 15.2 centimeters or 5.98 inches. You might be thinking, what about Central American countries or Mexico? Unfortunately, I couldn't find any research at all for those countries. For the next region, we will look at the Middle East. We're going to skip Saudi Arabia because I covered it last time in the first video. So first up will be Turkey. I found two pretty big studies for Turkey. In the first study, 1,132 Turkish men were measured and the mean stretched penile length is 13.7 centimeters or 5.39 inches. In the second study, 2,276 Turkish men had a mean stretched penile length of 13.98 centimeters or 5.5 inches. Next will be Iran. In this study of 1,500 men from Iran, researchers found that their mean stretched penile length is 11.58 centimeters or 4.56 inches. Although this study has many men, it has only stretched length. We have seen in the case of Israel in the first video that the erect length can be much longer than the stretched length. Then we have Iraq. For 223 men in this study, the mean stretched penile length is 12.6 centimeters or 4.96 inches. With 223 men, it's not a tiny study, but it's not a huge study either. So this number may not represent the entire Iraq. Now, moving on to East Asia and Southeast Asia. In East Asia, we will do Japan first. I only found one research with 63 men from Japan that has penile measurements, and these numbers actually came from cadavers. Well, the mean stretched penile length for them is 11.2 centimeters or 4.41 inches. There are some problems with this study though. First, with 63 men, it's a really small study. Second, because these numbers are measured on people who passed away, there could be inaccuracies during measuring because bodies tend to be really stiff when people die. That means it might be really hard to stretch a dead person's penis when measuring. After Japan, we have Korea. I did find two studies for Korea. In the first study with 1,160 men, they measured a mean stretched penile length of 11.2 centimeters or 4.41 inches. In the second study with 144 men, the mean stretched penile length is slightly longer at 11.7 centimeters or 4.61 inches. As I mentioned, the stretched length may not equal the erect length. So it may very well be the case that similar to Israel, the Korean erect length is much longer than the stretched length. Also interesting is that the Korean numbers are quite close to the Japanese numbers. 
The last country with research data from Asia is Vietnam. This is a huge study with 14,597 Vietnamese men, and the mean stress penile length for all these men is 14.67 centimeters or 5.78 inches. With so many men in this study, I think we can be quite confident that the number is good. For the continent of Europe, in my last video, I went over all the European countries with research data, except I missed a country, Sweden. In this study, although it mostly talks about men with hypospadia, it did mention 49 healthy men with measured penises. Their mean stretched penile length is 11.6 centimeters or 4.57 inches. Please note that this study is extremely small with only 49 men. So, 11.6 centimeters might be entirely wrong when you talk about the entire country. The last continent I will talk about is North America, especially the USA. I already did the USA in the last video, but I did find another research study with 1,661 men from Indiana, USA. The mean erect penile length for them is 5.57 inches or 14.15 centimeters. Over 1,600 men is a very good sample size. The only big problem with this study is that unlike all the other studies that I mentioned so far, this study asked the man to measure themselves, which means it potentially could be biased because researchers have found that men tend to exaggerate their penis size if they measure it themselves. But this study has many more men than the 80 men study that I presented in the last video. So I thought I should at least mention this bigger study, even if it does have its faults. You guys can interpret these two studies as you like. Conclusion I hope you guys found it interesting to learn about the average penis size from so many countries and ethnicities. Please support us by subscribing. And remember, in the end, it doesn't really matter if your penis is a bit longer than the other guy or not. What's more important is how well you use it. If you haven't done so, be sure to check out my last video with 14 more countries on the same topic. Also, if you are interested in men's telehealth or ED drugs if prescribed from Cure.Expert, please see the description under the video. Thanks for watching! If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up and share. And if you have ideas for other health topics that you want to see, please let me know in the comments. See you next time!